Let's dive into the world of perks in the game. There are 35 of them, split into three categories, each offering different benefits. They can boost your movement, combat skills, help your team, or even mess with your enemies. They're like your personal game changers. Whether you're a pro or a newbie, it's important to know your perks. They come in three types, red, green, and blue. Red perks help with movement, utilities, and resistance. Green perks enhance your combat and survival abilities. Blue perks mainly offer support, counterplay, and score streak benefits. Now let's look at the best ones for you based on your playstyle. For aggressive search and destroy players, I recommend Lightweight for an extra 5% movement speed bonus, Gung Ho to hip fire, reload and use throwables while running, or Quick Fix to trigger health regeneration after a kill. For the blue perk, Dead Silence to reduce your footstep noise and remove it completely while walking. For situational perks, use Restock to replenish your equipment every 20 seconds and Hardwired to become immune from traps. Ghost is also good to counter enemies who use heartbeat sensors and enemy UAVs. For passive search and destroy players who prefer a slower, safer approach, I recommend Skulker for increased walking, crouching and strafing speed, Toughness to battle hit flinch whenever an enemy tries to engage with you, and Dead Silence to catch your enemies off guard and become the most annoying player for the enemy team. In respawn game mode, you have a lot more perks to choose from compared to SD. This is why it's crucial to have a variety of perks in your loadout. If you're the type of guy who likes to roam, get kills and clear objectives, here are some perks for you. Skulker or Lightweight for extra mobility. Tactician is also great to have an additional tactical utility to create more space. Use Dauntless to counter disable perk and Molotovs. Use Quick Fix to boost your survival as you will be facing enemies frequently. Then go with Dead Silence to reduce noise and play stealthy, and Tactical Mask to lessen the effects of enemy flash, stuns, gas, and more. If you're more of an anchor player who sets up and holds pawn points, or an OBJ player who locks down objective points, here are some perks for you. Use Fast Recover to increase your health recovery rate by 35% or Flak Jacket to reduce damage received from enemy explosives. Toughness to reduce your hit flinch. Ghost to stay hidden from enemy UAVs when you're going for nukes. And for the blue perk, use Hardline to get score streaks faster. And don't worry about not having dead silence. As a stationary target, you won't be moving much anyway. By the way, have you gotten a nuke this season yet? Let me know. What's your own favorite perk combination? Let us know down in the comments below. Now that you know our favorite perks, I think you should pair them with the top 10 assault rifles this season. You can check them out right here. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.